All right, so let's start with the big story that we are tracking on Vyond this morning. There are reports of a minor blast that took place near the Israeli embassy in New Delhi. No injuries have been reported. Now, the blast was reported at a time when the breathing, the retreat ceremony was underway. Now, according to reports that have come in, the mirrors of about two to three cars were broken due to the explosion. The multiple fire tenders were rushed to the spot and according to the New Delhi police, it was a very low improvised intensity device that went off roughly at about 5 p.m. Indian Standard Time on the APJ Abdul Kalam Road. They also found several steel shrapnel near the blast site. The police say that the initial impression suggests that a mischievous attempt was made to create some kind of a sensation. Now, the area has been cordoned off and officers are scanning the CCTV cameras installed nearby to ascertain the sequence of events. And according to sources, investigators also recovered an envelope from the spot and the text written on it is related to some Israeli embassy officials. The investigators are looking into whether it is linked to the incident or not at this point of time. Now, according to officials, Israel is treating the bomb blast, the low intensity blast near its embassy in New Delhi as a terror incident. And soon after the, after the blast, India's External Affairs Ministry and also its Israeli counterpart put out a statement. Now, India's External Affairs Minister S. Jayashankar has spoken to his Israeli counterpart Gabi Ashkenazi regarding this explosion where about two to three cars' windows were shattered. And Jayashankar has assured Israel of fullest protection to its diplomats and also to everyone in the Israeli mission. In a tweet, he said that India has taken the incident very seriously. But Jayashankar also added that the matter is under investigation and Israeli Foreign Minister Ashkenazi has promised full cooperation and help to India in a tweet. A statement from the Israeli government has confirmed no injuries or damages to its property. The Israeli ambassador to India has also reacted to the blast and has said that he is getting full cooperation and support from the Indian authorities. There has been an explosion just outside the Israeli embassy in New Delhi. Fortunately, nobody is hurt. All the diplomats and their families are safe. Thank you so much for your concern. This explosion happens exactly when we mark 29 years for the establishment of full diplomatic relations between Israel and India. And especially in these days, the strong and warm friendship between Israel and India reflects itself. We get full cooperation and support from the local police, from the Indian authorities, the Ministry of External Affairs, the Secretary of External Affairs, the NSA, they all call their counterparts in Israel, offer their support. We appreciate it so much. Thank you again for your concern. Now, according to Reuters, which quoted an Israeli official, Israel is treating this low intensity tiny bomb blast near its embassy as some kind of a terror-related incident. The entire area has been cordoned off and heavy deployment of the police has also been made. At this point of time, the police has not released any kind of CCTV footage related to the blast. More information, of course, is awaited. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.